A look at Lake Eola in the shadow of downtown Orlando. A breathtaking sunset in Central Florida. Hello from 2K Sports. We're honoring diversity and culture tonight with the NBA celebration of Noche Latina. And along with Grant Hill and Doris Burke, I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Ali LaForce, our reporter. Ali, take it away. Brian, thanks. Kyrie Irving has settled in Brooklyn after his time in Cleveland and Boston. He said, I'm grateful to be in a position to set a better example now. What I learned was, even on the bad days, you have to galvanize the group. And there isn't one leader. It's the balance of leadership. Guys. Over Bamba. And it's good. Off the back rim and in. Well, what a move from Kyrie to keep the defenders guessing as he moves in for the score. Pass to Wagner. Carter, high post. Here's Suggs. Off target at the rim. Irving against Anthony. Launches it. And Kyrie Irving good for three. Irving's got five. The Rock and looking for a shot. It's clear he's in a good rhythm. We'll be right back with you shortly. And he's one of the game's best closers, but to hear Kyrie Irving tell it, he's got to start, too. The coach just wants me to be aggressive, uh, you know, to set the tone early in the game. And, you know, that kind of sets up all my teammates and uh, sets the standard for the rest of the game and how I want the, the game to go. Where you get three of them. Pass to Ross. Tipped away. Irving against Fultz from 18 feet away, and the jumper falls for him. Irving's got seven points for the quarter. This guy is putting his fingerprints all over the game in this quarter. He has flat out dominated the offensive end. Well, you hear about the importance of confidence. You think that was something you always had as a player, Grant, or did you have to build that up? Well, I mean, success ultimately does breed confidence, and I had success fortunately at a young age so you have to understand you have to always attack and you always have to believe in your what a game it's been for Kyrie Irving he went on an historic scoring frenzy tallying a ridiculous number of points three rebounds and seven assists and he wasn't himself in that last contest but tonight he's really turned it around and from what we saw so far from the Nets Kenny what's your takeaway I like what they're doing offensively. Looking at their field goal position, they're moving the ball, getting great looks, and of course, they're knocking down shots. I mean, that's the point of the game, isn't it? Shaq, right? That's the point. Obviously. And Shaq, let's get your input on the Magic. It's their defense that's put them in the spot. Giving up easy looks all over the place. It's like they don't have even a, a game plan in place. Check out Ernie. I don't even want to talk about it no more. <sighs> Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Well, you look at Kyrie Irving in this game, he's been everywhere. Yeah, tonight he's done a great job of slashing through the lane and finishing. And part of that has to do with his mindset. He has been looking to push the action at every opportunity, and he has been in attack mode all night. Hey, who's watching you? Okay. Outside Irving. The three fires in the triple. Irving. Irving's got seven now in this quarter. This has been a running theme for him. Hit a number of threes in the first half. Now nails another. Here's Suggs driving inside. No good. Ooh, Durant with some nice D. I'll tell you, you hate to pin this on one person, but his inefficiencies at the offensive end are holding this group back. And they recover it. Pass to Irving. Jacks up a three. Another one falls. Amazing. And that gives him 51. Making it look easy. Orlando calls timeout. 
Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. Outside Durant. And the Nets, another three! <laughs> they're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Pass to Carter. Here's Hampton. He's got nine. Outside Ross. Clock at four. Over Johnson. Rebound Brooklyn. For the finish. And Durant with the big finish. Absolutely no mercy right now from Kevin Durant in transition. Those long strides. That's an easy buff. Orlando has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Here's Hampton, guarded by Durant. Here's Carter. Good work defensively by Drummond. I'll tell you, they're trying to cut into this lead, but he has not hit one this period. That's good from Durant on the assist by Brown. Durant's got 42 in the game. Boy, how about the range from Kevin Durant? Dial it in from another zip code. Two minutes, three Pass three to Ross. Two oh, it's blocked. It deflects off the backboard. From the high post. Good. He hits the jumper. Hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. We'll be right back. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. This is the definition of team chemistry. I love to see this kind of communication and connection between teammates leading to the perfect pass. Nothing better than chemistry, right? Working together to create a bucket. Durant, the pass to Irving. Now here's Jogic. Down low. Outside Irving. Shot clock at six. Good! That's another bucket! 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. Harris down low. Guarded by Durant. Hauled in by Brown. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. Here's Irving. Pass to Durant. Basket counts. Durant. Durant's got 49 in the game. Now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Kyrie Irving. Yeah, and this game really has his fingerprints all over it. He's been dominating and making it look effortless. It's always fun to watch someone just flat out take over like he's done here today. Boy, it's not hard to be blown away by his level of play. It's never easy winning on the road, but to do it in this fashion, that's a special performance right there.